Hey guys, welcome back to Man Cave Minute. Just want to do a brief video on this new item. It's from Iron Studios. It's the DC Comics 1 tenth scale art statue of Deathstroke. It's a polystone statue and he stands uh, right under 9 inches tall. It was just released. I know that there's an exclusive out there that comes with uh, two heads, but I'm not sure if that's available in the United States. Um, you get the, uh, of course, you get the masked head, and then you get the Slade Wilson with the eye patch. And the videos I've seen on that are um, videos I think out of Italy and Europe. So I'm not sure if that's uh, available here in the United States. Now this one is very nice. Has great detail, great sculpt. Look at that. Great paint application. It's based on the concept art of uh, Yvonne Rees. People also know him as Ivan Rees. The statue comes in a few pieces, the base being one, of course, the majority of the statue being two. Then you have the uh, removable head. There's a magnet there. And then that uh, belt of ammunition that goes around the back there, torso with the uh, scabbard on the back here, the sheath for the sword. That's another piece. So you would slide that in through the arm here. And once you have it there, then you'd pop in the head. Now this gun uh, does go in. You have some flex in the fingers there, so you shouldn't have a problem. And then of course the sword, which just slides into the hand there. Once you have it in, you can uh, twist it. Twist it around, there you go. So I'm really liking this piece. And I've said this before, and I'll say it again till the day I die, but um, Iron Studios and Kotobo Kia really need to step it up and start making more 1-6 scale statues. Imagine this in a 1-6 scale, or even in a 1-4. I mean, this looks awesome. Let's get a closer look at the detail on the body arm. Look at that, nice texture. You see that? That blue kind of reminds you of the old uh, Aquaman suit from the cartoon, the comics. Got a side blade, got a side arm there, got grenades on the belt, pouches, more grenades, more pouches. Great work. Now, um, at first, I didn't like the pose. It seemed kind of like a you know ballerina pose at first, but you know it's kind of grown on me. You know, it's an action pose in the air, firing a gun, swinging a swinging a blade. So not too concerned about it now. Now there is one peg that goes in there. Um, it feels sturdy, uh, but I do recommend that whenever you're dealing with any kind of statue, obviously you always want to have one hand on the base and one hand on the statue. Okay, be very careful. Very nice. I just want to do a brief video for you guys. I know. You don't like to get bombarded with too much details. So let's get a closer look at the face. Great work all around. Just on a larger scale would be awesome. But what can you do, right? There you have it guys, from Iron Studios, the DC Comics 1 tenth scale art statue of Deathstroke, now available. I have seen them on Big Bad Toy Store, Entertainment Earth, um, I believe even Amazon has it, and the price point on this one right now is about 110, 120. And it's supposed to be a limited edition, but I don't see anywhere on the box or on the base of a number, so I don't have any number on it. But they are still available, guys. I appreciate it. If you can let me know in the comment section below what you think. If you could thumbs up this video, I really would appreciate it, guys. Also, feel free to share it on Google+, Twitter, Facebook, anywhere you like, guys. And if you're not a subscriber, please do subscribe. More stuff is coming. And I will talk to you later.